You can drive American cars with one finger. And their boats too. When Mercury launched the Verado board engine series, it came with a special electro-hydraulic guidance system that just now has started with joystick piloting. The joystick is a very coveted instrument for large boat owners because it simplifies the docking manoeuvre. Up until yesterday, we had to make do with the tiller and inverter levers on little boats. But why not try to simplify manoeuvring even on boats without board engines? Well, Mercury's joystick piloting does just that. It works by controlling the engine's inverters and accelerators. It's based on a completely different installation than the ones used traditionally. The engines are set a distance apart and can rotate independently or in opposite directions as they aren't joined up by a coupling bar, but each has its own hydraulic actuator. The joystick piloting serves to engage the engines in forward or reverse gear, independently from each other. So manoeuvres any which way are possible, and even getting out of tight corners becomes easy. Obviously, you can manoeuvre the boat back and forwards and slow down, stop and then turn it around just by turning the knob of the joystick. It obviously activates for all directions. The engines move in a different way. They rise and change their trim for greater operational efficiency to the point that nothing can stop the propellers. But the most incredible manoeuvre is the lateral movement that you can do by moving the joystick laterally and then doing this, jiggling it a little bit forwards and a little bit backwards, back and forward. Like this, the manoeuvre is faster and more effective. Since their launch in 2003, Verado engines have shown real technological revolution. They are still the only outboard with a turbo compressor and have a specifically elevated power, so they are very sparky when it comes to acceleration and speed. Because of all this, it's necessary that the engines come equipped with a very precise and very efficient guidance system, similar, in fact, to that found in racing boats. Behind the helm, here, there are electrical sensors that give indications to two electrical hydraulic pumps that are close to the outboard. And it is because of their exact position that the system is so precise. As a result of all this, it's safer, especially when you're pushing to the maximum. The important thing is that both engines push in the same way, and that isn't the problem. The sync button perfectly synchronizes the two outboards. Even at full throttle, the boat responds well. The excellent characteristics of the Verado steering haven't changed. This Boston 32 Outrage, with its two 300 horsepower Verado engines, gets up to 46 miles per hour. It keeps perfectly on course. As always, for maximum speed, you must remember to fine-tune the trim because the joystick system raises the engines to manoeuvre better. But then it's up to you to find the best setup when you're out on the sea, which again is better because you need to watch the waves and adapt to get maximum speed. 
Okay, we're coming back into port. Let me show you one more thing. Naturalmente il joystick piloting può essere Of course, piloting with the joystick can be used along with other functions such as the skyhook that keeps the boat on the spot. Right now, for example, with this wind and currents on the beam, we should be pushed in towards the port. Instead, with this system, we're stopped. We can calmly put up the fenders and then go in. Con il joystick piloting di Mercury è veramente With Mercury's joystick piloting, it's very easy to maneuver. Who knows if one day they invent a system that will automatically give the rope.